pumping water in the regular flushing the black tank. Like crap. All right, now I'm gonna shut the valve here. <clears throat> Pumping into the black tank flush. Shut the valves. It fills the tank way up. You don't want to overflow it, of course. Then let it out for a big whoosh that hopefully will clear all your goodies out. How long should you wait? I have no idea. Like I wish I knew how much it took. Black tank flush. All right, let me go ahead and let it out. Oh yeah, big clumper dumper. Another one. The tank ended up having way more in there than I thought. And I guess it makes sense after a couple of weeks probably. So some of those big chunks coming out were just the beginning and it's about to get a lot worse. So I filled up the tank once again, pretty full, just estimating. Hey! Alright, now I'm going to drain it once again. Oh yeah. Notice the now non-existent flow of water, that means there's a major clog. Good lord, there must be a major clog in there still. Right now we're hitting up against. There ain't hardly no water coming out. Oh, it's right there. about to break loose though. Hey! Lisa! You flush the toilet some? When you're done, just run, flush the toilet non-stop for a minute. Yeah, it's totally clogged and not moving, which is not good. A little bit more. Oh, when it's like a bright loose, it's going to be a... Sucker breaks loose now. Oh, it's right there. See it? Oh shit! Something's leaking. Something's leaking. 
started a leak and drip from underneath the RV. Not sure where from, but something over Is it fire. leaking inside? I don't know. It's leaking underneath. Not good. Not good at all. Oh, great. Yeah, it's dripping water underneath. Yeah, there's a major clog right there because there's no water coming out. Still dripping underneath. Lesson learned on that one. Brand new RV. Well, brand new to us. And now it stinks. Forgot a hose is a great snake these don't have snake out spots so i had to pull the thing off try to snake it and stick it back on which is about impossible the clear outlet there is genius so you can see but it would definitely benefit from having a t and an outlet you know an inlet to snake the line if you had to Hopefully I don't get shit all over myself. I didn't quite get it, of course. Now I gotta try it again and avoid the Let's got to do it again. I mean, I don't know. It might be. It might have broke free while I was in there. What was that? It was kind of right there. It's not far in there. See, all oh, we got the toilet paper start coming out. So but why is it doing that? Too much shit in toilet paper. See, I didn't get it still. And another failed attempt. It's the original great satisfaction when you finally do break one of these septic tanks or RV tanks loose and all that crap flows out. Great satisfaction. Come on, man. Check the button. Two lights? Yeah. I'm gonna try to fill it again and, and, and have a big gush. Okay. I missed the best of it. I think I got it.
was able that time to fill the tank, shut the valve off, and create a big bunch of pressure behind the clog to push it all down the line. There's still paper and stuff coming out. That's what you want to see it running totally clear. No more brown water pieces of toilet paper floating through. All right, one more flush. I got my black filling. I'm gonna shut this off. Filling it up creates a big whoosh through the tank. Hopefully, theoretically, pushes all the stuff that's settled to the bottom or whatever out. Looks like we finally got success. Congratulations and thank you. Make sure like and subscribe. Come on back and watch some more videos. I'm going to have a lot more about living the RV life. Pros and cons and a review of the uh, RV we recently picked up. Alright, flush out here. Looks like it's clear.